Tapped again. Healed again. Is it gonna be enough? Sumail. Again. Is it gonna be enough? Sumail. Satanic in one second. Can he get it off? He can. The burrow through. He holds oh, his ground. No way. Sumail, he's got it in three that can just farm really fast, so we may see him fall back to the jungle fairly soon, use these velocities. Right now, he's just trying to deny everything with him. You attack at the same time, it's so impossible to last hit against three units hitting at the same time. Yeah, even for PL, who has 78 uh, damage with the Phantom Rush, it's going to be even more. And yeah. Quelling Blade, it's still kind of tricky. So I think the early levels are bad for Chen, but once you get the second point in Holy Persuasion, you have an edge. Fissure is not going to yeah, quite Soxa. fully block off Soxa. He doesn't have a point into Crepify yet. They're going to chase him down. Stick was already committed, and it looks like Soxa may just survive. The Fissure still on cooldown. One more spear just barely secures the kill. If no tell, TP sooner with an Impale may have been able to save him, but... And that, that was... A two for one on Bounty Runes is round okay. two of the action. Wow. Top lane, no tell, getting stunned. The Fissure block. They maledicted. Can they finish him off? Good stun on two. With the PL, can they find more? Finally, no tells hit level six. He crafts a, a counter gank and turns it around. Seb with a good two hero Burrow Strike into a call down. Echo to interrupt this, the Carapace to interrupt that. They keep on going. Burrow Strike cooling down soon. They'll have another, but do they have the firepower? Yeah, Sor, gotta get the hell out of there. He can't. That's three. Are they having one of those OG fights? You betcha. Can I clean them up? No, they get them all, except for the Kunkka of Nisha, but they're hunting they for him. Seb, he's got the Burrow. Up the life drain. Yep. As you mentioned, Chen's just tanky. It was a Borrow Strike into two hero Impale that allowed the cooldown to hit both those heroes twice. And then they got a Carapace to interrupt the Echo, and here we go now. The OG run at you machine is heating up, but Zai there to counter it. Gets the quick kill on the Pugna. Now the boat coming through. Zed, can they burst him? This guy is the arsenal of the team fight, and down he goes. That's a double for Zai. Secret right back in action, diving after no tail. Zai trying to predict, get some he's the shock. He's got no, he's got the dust. Okay, so I was about to say, <laughs> I didn't see because he knows how tanky he is. He has 2000 HP with an essence ring and a hood, but there was enough damage on the OG side, and the chain stuns caught him by surprise because. He really should have just disengaged there. They scan to the pit. They've got a smoke oh, on Yapsor. He's got Echo go. Slam in 10. They gotta go soon though, LD. I don't think they're gonna have time. Yapsor. Maybe they still try for a five, five second select. Oh, it's too late. Size lumbering towards the pit. He's gonna get Carapace done. This could get really Side ugly. Die. Yaps waiting in the wings. Look for the Blake. Look for the Echo. Or maybe just look for Zai to get the hell away. They do not want to fight into this. No tail. Runs it with the Carapace. Gets the fob stun. In comes Yapsor. Blink a chant totem. And they do eradicate the infestation. No tail down. But Aegis secret counterplay and somehow he escapes. Yeah. Even with the Chen heals, it just, it was not nearly enough when 33 used them in the last fight. Now we have a mech on Puppy's Witch Doctor, so even the five positions getting some items for the team here. Puppy taking his 10% and spending it wisely for Secret's benefit. That's probably about accurate. He's got about, you know, 10% of the team net worth, less than the 20% of oh, that would be even distribution. The math checks out. Yep. Yeah. Up to a 12k gold lead now, Secret. At, what's the next step here? Are they trying to end the game soon? Are you content to just take it easy? They have PL, and PL late game should still do okay versus the Gyrocopter, assuming you have a net worth lead, because you just get all these annoying items and just kind of chip away at him. You constantly burn his mana, you're gonna later on have like an Abyssal Blade, uh, you have the sustain from items like Satanic if you wanna go that, so I don't think they're in a rush to end this, but it is to control set. the map, yeah. Burrow strikes back to safety. They did scan to confirm that Biter legs, and he's already backing out. They might get Nisha though. Oh, this could be bad. Burrow strike through. He doesn't have his BKB yet, which it looks like he was trying to get towards. And with the help of the Pugna, they do bring him down with ease. Still killable in a 5v1 scenario. And that question is, can they take an actual head-on fight? Seb's looking for more. He gets the Shaker here to start Pearl Strike. Oh, it's just a tad early, and it looks like Yapsor is going to be absolutely fine. Lotus Orb now protecting Yapsor. Oh, we and he backs out, waiting for the Fissure, but he can't blink in for the moment. He's going to try to retreat out, but they're still locking down Zai. Sox is coming in. He does have the Life Drain, the Yules to interrupt. Call down to meet Zai as he hits the deck. There was no buyback available on the... Into the Impale. Can Puppy turn this? He's got the Mech available, but the Carapace done by No-Tail. 
It's on point. Puppy now being isolated, forced away. They will get the kill. Anisha, the trade was Matumba Man flanking from behind the torch. Going on yeah. And Matumba Man's cleaning up the backlights. Gets 33. Gets Soxa. Now into the pit where Seb tries to worm his way out of this. Can he escape? Throw a strike. But oh, a no. Fissure locking him in. And it's death for Seb. Three down again. It's just taking too long to get these kills. Yeah. They had to. Sumail had to commit his BKB for the kill. And once he used it for the Timbersaw, he's like, okay, four heroes are running in on us. My BKB's wearing off. What do I do? I'm just going to TP home. He knew there was a bad fight. So Sumail doesn't die, but he doesn't have any way for his teammates to get out of that fight. And he's just probably happy he didn't get found by a PL Basher, which would have canceled that BKB TP. And I think, I think the Abyssal Blade is coming soon. He's got the recipe in the yeah. stash. May not even need it at this rate. Secret banging on the front door now, kicking it down. They storm into the OG base. They're looking for the melee racks. Uncontested, still no set for 20 seconds. It's not unwinnable if they lose the lane gods. They've got a lot of faith clear but it's going to be an uphill battle for sure. Secret do get the full lane. No tail creeps forward. Does he dare to commit? He'll let Secret scurry back, and Secret now up a full lane of Rex. Yeah, the plan for OG is very much just hope this rapier is like the Hail Mary that will turn this game around for Secret. They're playing very disciplined Calm Dota. They catch up. No tell here with a sentry, though. He's walked into the trap. Does get off the carapace, but Yapsor there with the Enchant Totem, the Fissure Block, and the Dust follow-up. They came prepared to deal with him, and No-Tail is now down the chase forward onto Soxa. Can they slow him down? Chakram available, Yule Scepter cooling down. Looks like they should have him on the other side of the fight. Matumba Man, he's zoning the other three heroes away. In fact, charging into them, dodging away. They don't even manage to threaten him. He's diving up the tier four towers. He wants to end them now. He does. It's Matumba Man is really in there. And the Torrent Storm will cover his retreat. So, successful zoning, forces out the pug to buy back. <laughs> they get both supports. Can they get the second lane? I don't know if they want to take this fight still. OG, even with Paladin Sword and the Rapier, that is a massive item. Yeah, the free lifesteal from the neutral item, plus he's going to have a Solar Crest from his Chen, so he's getting buffed up a lot. We've seen these Rapier, uh -oh. Gyros, and Medusas often turn games around, but said that is the power of the Butterfly. Yep. Rapier or not, the Illusion's just shredding it, forcing out under a Glyph. Now five minutes where any damage done is unblockable. Yep, no repair kits on OG this game. So Matumba Man has switched in a dragon scale. Okay, now he's going to go back to the okay, hit claw. That Interesting. Seems... Uh, maybe he was switching it in just for the tower damage? For the... Does it work on the illusion? I uh, have no idea. Summer? I'm actually not sure. Oh, I'm, I'm more, more the damage. Kept again, healed again. Is it going to be enough? Sumail? Again. Is it going to be enough? Sumail, Satanic in one second. Can he get it off? He can. Crept again. Healed again. Is it going to be enough? Sumail, Satanic in one second. Can he get it off? He can. The burrow through. He oh, he's doing it. No way. Sumail, he's got it in three. PL is coming back. Nisha's on the run. He can it. force him down. That's four. The Tumba's the last man standing. Can they kill him off? To crap. Suck. Stun. He gets off the Abyssal. He charges the other way. Matumba trying to find the kills. Where are they? They're nowhere. Oh, the it's the Chen stun follow up with the net. They're going to do it. They get all five. Holy shit. What's going on, OG? And they don't even lose the Rex. We've seen a TI. Never say never. In comes no Tail. Oh, uh, well, that's not how you want the fight to start. Not with three heroes getting locked out with the Torn Storm combo. And Sumail first of all. Can he do the damage? Stands his ground with the call down. But Matumba Man muscling his way through him. They try to save him with Soxa. They get up the stun. No Tail with the save. But Sumail, he's got to get out. He doesn't have Satanic. Oh, does he? No, he's been decrept. He's got to back away. Soxa keeps healing him. Wow. He survives. They did have to use a buyback there. But in No Tail with the Carapace again. So many interruptions. It doesn't seem to matter as Matumba still has ages. He's got the Illusionist Cape too. Charges forward, looking for the No Tail kill again. Can they get it? Burrow straight forward, looking for the commitment. Seb still holding on to that epicenter. Not that it matters all that much as Gyro decrept again, healed again. Is it going to be enough? Sumail, Satanic in one second. Can he get it off? He can. The Burrow through. He holds oh, his ground. Doing it. No way. Sumail, he's got it in three. PL is coming back. Nisha's on the run. He can it. force him down. That's four. The Tumba's the last man. Up the abyssal, he charges the other way. Matumba trying to find the kills. Where are they? They're nowhere. Oh, the it's the Chen stun follow up with the net. They're gonna do it. They get all five. Holy shit. What's going on, OG?
OG, and they don't even lose the Rex! <laughs> These guys, they're playing like they want a TI or two. These guys are insane. This is looking like a... What does it matter if he drops the Rapier? It's gonna be tough. Radiant. Seeker keep on sieging. Matumbo with the DD. They burrow to deal with the illusions, and now the jump forward instantly assassinates yeah, No Tail. Out for 50. It's a 4v5 power play, and Secret just focused on objectives, bringing down the melee. They will look for their second lane, but the glyph is here. A little time bought. The heart not quite ready yet for Sumail. He needs, or actually, he could buy it. But if there's a lot going on. Shop, yeah. Looks like maybe his courier is coming from the enemy secret shop with it. All right. Very clever. So yeah, so we go from the enemy secret shop. So now with 3,500, oh wait, it's going to be more. 4,300 HP gyro, but down two lanes. Yeah. He can still be overwhelmed. If PL gets on top of him, there's bashes, there's a lot of kiting. I don't think he's going to necessarily be able to just suddenly that take Echo Slam, the line. Hex, the Ghost Ship Fleet. Yeah. The I mean, PL's afraid, I think. He can't that hard commit to this Rax when there's a double rape you gyro company to punish you, so. The best way to do it with a double rape or no boots gyrocopter just stay the hell away from him. He's a slow bastard. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. I think if you're secret, you are looking to keep that bottom lane pushed in and keep poking at the tier fours. I mean, the, these PL illusions, it's not just the, yeah, the, the racks you can poke at. You take those tier fours out, we've seen countless times, backdrop protection in like these 78 minute games doesn't mean a whole lot. Not that secret have good heroes to hit buildings with. That's part of the problem they find themselves in is they can't kill buildings. PL, a very slow sieger and Kunkka. They're just walking down mid and no tail is there to start things mm. off. But it's on to PL with an Aegis. It's mana. This is always so annoying when you're playing against PL. These illusions, making more illusions, burning your mana. Now they're going to smoke. I don't... Will Secret expect this? They're positioned like they know it's coming. They've got a fresh gem on Yatsor. Oh. But it's actually Seb who gets the jump. The chain stun is there. 33 comes in. But the torrent to interrupt this. Yap is going to go down. He does have buyback. Loses his gem, though. That's two gems down, or what, did he get his back? I'm not sure. Uh, I think that's the second gem they've lost, maybe. There's a double gem on Nyx, so right, they can probably buy a new one because it's cooled down. Sumail did get his Ag's Blessing, so now has Boots again. A little extra attack speed. That's nice for him, yeah. He can be pulled back into this fight, I imagine. They're going to need him. It really shows the mentality of OG that they are all in. D no buyback on the gyrocopter. They're just going to do everything they can to keep him alive. Earthshaker not the using his health. The buildings are melting. They're going to bring down the tier three. OG. Finally in the enemy base for the first time this game, and Matumba Man, he's had enough. He's gonna buy a rapier of his own. Still Sumail, standing strong. He's almost brought down two racks with this. On the backside, they try to engage forward. The PL army doing decent work. Can they call a puppy? He's in the middle of it. The stunts are coming through from the Jet Army. Matumba Man being dealt with for the moment. Sumail is pummeling him, forcing it back. They get the puppy kill. He's out for two minutes. On the south side, Sumail, he's too big to fail. He just keeps on charging in. Matumba Man, he's gotta get away. The Hex, the save. He still gets the kill. The PL is gonna buy that. Rapier's hitting the deck. Sumail still with his two. The ghost ship fleet. What is it gonna matter? Top of man. Back in the fight. Rapier on him as well. I guess, actually, I guess he didn't have it. It was in the stash. And now they chase forward. This charge is Echo slam by Yatsor. Can't stop three. But Pete interrupted. Can they bring him down? They've got to deal with Sumail. Hex. He's They're got ignoring satanic. Him. They're ignoring him. Trying to kill the backliners first. The backliners are starting to drop. Pugged up by back. Now they deal with No Tail. No Tail to drop. Sumail standing strong for the moment. There's a good burrow. But Tumba, though, gets the Lotus Sword. That makes it hard to follow this up. Now the torrent coming through. They're working him down. Sumail stands strong, though. They might lose Seb. Sitting on the Shock room, can he make it out? It's just impossible to kill Sumail when his teammates are life stunning people. They've gotten one lane, guys. They're only one lane down. This health regen amplification is insane. You get 50% from the heart, you get 17% from the Paladin Sword, and then you get life steal from Satanic, life steal from Paladin Sword, extra regen from your Chen, from your Pugna. Every heal is being amplified and doubled and quadrupled. I don't even know the math on this. It's and just like... he wants another AP. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. What? He's like, they can't kill me, so I need to make sure that they have to address me, and triple rape is the best way to do that. Yaps are on a little mission there to recover a gem is successful, and it's time for number three. Sub 60 minute triple rapier gyro. The one rapier on Matumba. Oh, <laughs> Four rapier 
Ryan's in the game, I do believe. And still a 30k gold lead, and it feels like Secret are one bad fight away from losing this game. Yep. Nobody has buyback except for Seb. You gotta kill the backline. They're going secret. for the throne, or thinking about it. You need they a head in. Tier mail. four, they do torrent him once, but can they kill him off? Everything slowly being lobbed at him, but the buildings, they're not dying slowly at all. They're dying very quickly, but Tumble Man chase on Zasaxa. Can he burst him in time? Ignoring the fight. No, he can't kill He's him off. He's running the He's at the so Bale's ending the game. OG going for the jugular. Can they do it? Keeping the time to throw a line for now, but Puppy standing his ground. Look at it go. There's the torrent. It's too much regen. The torrent starts coming through. So Bale's still full HP. It's an echo. They're throwing everything. The kitchen sink. The refrigerator. He's the oven. Through. It doesn't matter. OG will not be denied. Four heroes dead. It's going to be five. It's a wipe. It's an ultra kill. It's a way. Unbelievable.